Listen, I'll, I'll have to ring you back. What's up with him, Ted? <laughs> it looks like the last of the alcohol has left his system. I think he might actually be sober. Is that it, Father? Are you seeing things as they really are at last? Oh, my God! <laughs> yes, that's it, all right. I suppose sobriety for Father Jack must be sort of like taking some mad hallucinogenic. Where are the other two? <laughs> the other two? <laughs> ah, I see. The old vision is back to normal. No, there's just the two of us, Father. And what do you two do, then? We're priests. What? Priests? Don't tell me I'm still on that feckin' island! <laughs> well, well, yes, yes, Father. Uh, how do you feel? Uh, must be great to be sober every once in a while, or even every 12 years. Cheer! <laughs> well done, Father. <laughs> Curtains! Yes, that's right! Floor! <laughs> All coming back to you, is it, Father? Gobshite! <laughs> yes! I remember! I remember! I'm off on my Lenten pilgrimage now, Fathers. Oh, off to St. Patrick's Hill. What's that, Ted? Oh, it's a big mountain. You have to take your socks off when you go up it. And once you get up to the top there, they chase you all the way back down with a big plank. <laughs> it's great fun. <laughs> I don't want it to be any fun at all, Father. I want a good, miserable time. Keep me on the straight and narrow. I met a couple there last year, and it did them the world of good. They were a bit obsessed with the old S-E-X. God, I'm glad I never think of that type of thing, Father. That whole sexual world. God, when you think of it, it's a dirty, filthy thing, isn't it, Father? <laughs> Can you imagine, Father, looking up at your husband and him standing over you with his lead in his hand, wanting you to degrade yourself? God almighty, can you imagine that, Father? <laughs> Picture it there, Father. Oh, get a good mental picture. Can you see him there, ready to do the business? Doorbell! Doorbell, Mrs. Doyle, the doorbell. Hey, 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 you there! What the hell is this? Uh, and it's a spoon, Father. Come on, she'll be here. Might as well go and meet her. Hello there. Ah, Sister Assumpta! Hello, Father. <laughs> Dougal, Dougal, do you remember Sister Assumpta? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> She was here last year, and then we stayed with her in the convent, back in Kildare. Do you remember it? Ah, you do. <laughs> and then you were hit by the car when you went down to the shops for the paper. You must remember all that. And then you won £100 with your lottery card. Ah, you must remember it, Dougal. And weren't you accidentally arrested for shoplifting? <laughs> I remember we had to go down to the police station to get you. And the police station went on fire? <laughs> and you had to be rescued by helicopter? Do you remember? You can't remember any of that? Huh? The helicopter! When you fell out of the helicopter! Over the zoo! Do you remember the tigers? <laughs> you don't remember! Uh, you were wearing your blue jumper. Ah, Sister Assumpta! Hello there! Hello. I have to say, I had no idea, Sister Assumpta, that you were with the Matty Hislop crowd. Oh, yes. Ever since I read his pamphlets, Abstinence has been both my keeper and my reward. Yeah, great. Well, anyhow, all we want is the basic 50 quid job, the bare essentials. Keep us off the booze and fags and uh, the rollerblading. I'm afraid the rollerblading is my own particular vice. Oh, well, we'll do our best. I'm looking forward to it. You know, I sort of am myself. <laughs> do us good to exercise the old willpower. What about you, Father Jack? Are you looking forward to it? Uh, you remember Father Jack, don't you? Oh, yes. <laughs> Nan! <laughs> no, it's none. None! Ah! Hi, Father. Uh, he's just gone for his walk. <laughs>